Hi, Mowbray here for commentary with Sue Smith alongside me. And we've got live Premier League action for you today. It's Chelsea and they take on Manchester United. Well, thanks as always, Guy. It's a real pleasure to be here. It's been buzzing ahead of kickoff. Let's hope the football lives up to the atmosphere. Here's how Chelsea line up. It's a 4-5-1, or you could say a 4-2-3-1. This does offer plenty of threat going forward with the three behind the central striker. We may see the wide midfielders cut in and the full-backs push on, while the defence is still protected from the two holding. Here's how Manchester United line up. Andre Onana is in goal. Raphael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire as the centre-backs. And what a chance! It's cleared, and they can breathe easier. The pass was red, and the ball has changed hands. And a challenge there that will surely result in a card. An early yellow card. Well, that might set the tone. Well, he needs to be a bit smarter there so early on in the game to get booked. May change how he approaches the rest of the game. Switched on and ready to intercept there. Well, on his day, Raheem Sterling can be absolutely unplayable. You'd think he'd probably play a prominent role here. Well, he's a unique talent, isn't he? The way he can beat the field. Oh, good opportunity! And that's not a bad save at all. They take it short, put into the box, and just over the bar. Yeah, it's a well-worked corner, and he makes decent contact, just lacking that little bit of accuracy. Gusto. is looking good now what comes next and that's pretty straightforward for the keeper a little careless there as the ball changes hands Fernandez will have a go here and it's been kept out by the tips of the fingers. And Chelsea can keep the attack going with a corner. It's been delivered. Well, he got the header in, but it's just gone over. Yeah, he'll be gutted that he didn't score here. It's a good delivery, sharp movement in the box, but can't find the back of the net. Rashford. Chelsea come away with the ball. Sterling. Has to be. No, that's superb from the defender. The approach play looked encouraging, but good defending to snuff out any threat. Edging ever closer to goal here. And maybe that was purely a misconnection with the ball. Yeah. 
No time to dwell on the ball. Oh, a challenge we used to call a professional foul. Surely a yellow card. And the name has been taken for that. It's silly, isn't it? Has to go in the book for that. No surprise to see him go direct for goal, but a pretty routine save in the end. On he goes, terrific. Gallagher, that was a chance to open the scoring. Well, that's a huge opportunity to take the lead, and he just doesn't compose himself. He can see the frustration on his face. Hello, And that has stopped any potential danger. Nkunku. Nkunku. Well, what a play for the lead here. Very, very close, but hit too hard to get the bend that was needed to score. Casimiro. Bruno Fernandes. This looks promising from United. Options available in the middle. Fernandes. Kunku. Well, it was looking good, but ultimately nothing doing. Gallagher. Perfectly anticipated, really well won. Well, Jeff Shreves is right in the mix down there, and he can tell us more about the injury now. Oh, there's some real concern looks from the bench, I have to tell you, because he's landed right on top of his elbow, and that's causing him some serious pain at the moment. Cheers, Jeff. Able to come away with the ball. This looks promising from Chelsea. The ref allowing the game to flow. Encouraging signs to the attack, but it hasn't led to anything. Hernandez. Oh, chance here. And the keeper more than equal to it. Over it comes. More defensive work to do here. And that brings the first half to a close here in West London. Raheem Sterling struggled to get involved in the game to this point. He won't be getting top marks for this display. Yeah, he's not been involved enough for me. Not seen enough for the ball. I think if they're to kick on in the second half, it's key that they get the ball into his feet just that little bit quicker. It's 
So nothing between them as the second half kicks off. He's beaten his marker here. Good cross into the middle. Oh, yes! Timing, technique, a terrific way to score. Well, we can see it again now. He does so well to slip past his man, leaves him stranded, and the movement is good to get on the end of it. And it's a simple finish in the end. Chelsea get the ball moving again. Can they get themselves together for a quick reply? And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. Real opportunity. And that is a wonderful opportunity wasted. Well, what a chance to equalise. He's just not clinical enough in front of goal. Struggling to keep the ball there. Need to get tighter here. And this could be. It's there. That didn't last long. They're back level already. Again, you do have to feel for the keeper. He's left completely exposed at the back, and he never really had much of a chance. It's poor defending, you have to say. And the game restarts with the score one all. Lovely ball. Now, what can they do with it? United have possession again. Moving forward well. Casimiro. Excellent reading of the game to win the ball. Stop to turn the ball away. Well, you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score here. Certainly piling the pressure on now. Really should be ahead. Fernandez. And it's on now. A body in the way. Hornet United now. And maybe an opportunity to get their noses in front. Into the box it goes. Well, a decent effort, but not quite the contact he was looking for, and it's comfortably wide in the end. Enzo Fernandez, Gallagher. The approach play looked encouraging, but good defending to snuff out any threat. And have a go here. 
and he fails to trouble the keeper. Yeah, it's a decent strike that, but look at the keeper's position. He read the shot and had it covered. When you look at the stats, it shows just how I feel the game's gone. It's been a brilliant watch. Both sides having a go, creating lots of opportunities. Let's hope that this continues. United moving forward with options available. And that's a shame for them, nothing doing. Now there could be a chance to counter. Rashford. And that has stopped any potential danger. We have to think quickly here. Moving forward under no real pressure. Oh, worth a shot. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to probably stop that. He wasn't given anywhere else to go there. This looks really good. Could we see a winning goal? Well, it looked promising, but only up to a point. Well, it's been a frustrating day for these fans. They want a goal and they're urging them to attack. Gallagher. And it's kept out. They've got their keeper to thank for still being level. Well, when he's called upon, he's ready. And that's such a good save at a really crucial time in the game. It's brilliant from the keeper. And here it comes. Curled right into the goalkeeper's zone. And he's caught it. Bruno Fernandes. So much room out wide now for United. There could be a chance to win the game here. Rashford. Oh, that's not properly away. Well, any chance has gone for now. Having a try. Breaking up pace. This could be dangerous. They need to get bodies back. The goalkeeper more than ready for it. And the corner is fired in. And the keeper more than equal to it. And out of play for another corner. And all those waiting for service will go on waiting. Rashford. Beaten easily here. Now, if they score from this, they'll surely win the game. Oh, a great chance. Kept out, but for how long? And the play breaks down. Noni Madueke. The counter looks on here. Options available. And it's on now. And that's a decent save. At least certainly made to look that way. And that's a corner. It could be decisive. Delivered into the box. And the referee blows for full time. Away we go, the start of extra time.
Chelsea finding space on the flank. And you can feel the frustration after that. Possibly should have hit the target. Just take a look at the stats. They'll certainly be happy with the build-up play and the chances that they're creating. But it's about being clinical in front of goal now and making those opportunities count. Gallagher. Gallagher. This for the lead. And there is proof that pure force isn't always the answer. It needed a more subtle touch. Anthony. They're not getting close enough here. But not the end result they wanted from an encouraging position. We'll have a go here. And good work from the keeper to get across and deal with the danger. United have a corner now and could take the lead with a good one. taken short Rashford what a chance that's really well read to get it away space out wide for Chelsea he's beaten his marker here has to be and the goalkeeper does what he's there to do a free kick awarded here. The refs viewed that as a foul. <laughs> McTominay. The ball back with Chelsea now. Gallagher. And they've scored a goal to get the stadium jumping. Here's the replay, and he does well to find space. But you'd always expect him to score from that sort of range. And the game restarts with very little time left for any more drama. Aaron Wan-Bissaka. On to McTominay. Now to go a long way with this. Real opportunity. Well, there we are. The first half of extra time is over. First kick of the second period of extra time. He's in here. The goalkeeper more than ready for it.
Christian Eriksen. Varane. Here's McTominay. He's done well to get past his marker. And it's a good diving save, although one you'd expect to be made. Axel Di Sassi. Now it's Thiago Silva. Gusto. space and he's finding it but that's where any chance of anything developing disappears Chelsea going through the gears just needs the composure now and still the chance might come well a promising attack but unable to take advantage The crowd encouraging him to take it on, and it's been kept out to keep them in the contest. Yeah, if that had gone in, I wouldn't have seen a way back for them. Not much time left now, so what an important save that was. Not enough power or placement in the header, and it's easy for the keeper. Not long to go, but there could be something happening for them now. Well, a chance might have developed, but not now. There is the final whistle, and it's Chelsea who take the three points. It was a real hard-fought game. Both teams showed moments of quality. They worked hard, but overall, they'll be happy with the result and the performance.